So we'll start at the top in my 8-9 game. Texas is the 8 seed. Tennessee is the 9 seed. Um, I have a home game in DKR. I think Texas beats Tennessee. I think Nico, as much as, as good as I think he's going to look throughout the year, I think he goes on Austin in a playoff environment and struggles. I think an experienced Quinn Ewers and Sark um, get out of there to face Ohio State in the next round. Five seed Oregon taking on 12 seed Liberty. I think Oregon is going to beat the Braves off of them just like they did last year in the bowl game. Um, so they will move on to face four seed Miami. Seven seed Old Miss um, taking on 10 seed Notre Dame. Um, while I think Riley Leonard is a gamer, um, I think Jackson Dart um, is even more of a gamer. And I'm going to take Jackson Dart, Ole Miss, and Lane Kiffin in the SIP um, to move on and face my three seed Utah Utes. And in my 6 11 game, Penn State being the sixth seed, hosting Missouri Tigers for a playoff game. Hopefully, it would be a wideout and happy valley, it would make me very happy. Uh, but I have Penn State moving on. I just think they would, you know, muck up the game a little bit if they played Missouri in a playoff game um, and get out of there with the win like 24 to 16 or something like that. We'll go back up to the top. One seed Ohio State taking on eight seed Texas. Um, I think this could be almost a national championship level game. Um, I think Ohio State would squeak it out. Um, yes, it'll be neutral site. And I think Texas not having a running back running back might catch up to them. What happens if their third string, their true freshman that they like so much gets hurt as well? Maybe they lose a couple guys on the outside. They don't have the defensive line that they did last year. I think it's match up with Ohio State's physicality. Um, so I'm going to take Ohio State to move on to the final four. For Miami taking on five seed Oregon. Um, I'm going to take Oregon as much as much as I'm on the Cam Ward hype train this year. I think Dylan Gabriel by that point will be very, very comfortable in Dan Lanning's system. Um, and I think they'll be rolling by that point. And, you know, it'll, I think it'll be a great game. Um, but I would pick the Oregon Ducks in that one. Three seed Utah taking on seven seed Old Miss. I should have wrote down what games these would have been. Um, I don't know. Maybe that'd be the Rose Bowl. Uh, but we're going to go Utah beating Old Miss, which might be an upset to some. They probably would not be favored in that game. Um, and just like I took Jackson Dart um, over Riley Leonard, if I'm going by quarterbacks, me personally, I think Cam Rising in this spot would be an absolute gamer like we saw him in the Pac-12 championship games and so many games in his career. And I think they would take down Ole Miss as the home team with Kyle Whittingham being getting to the Final Four. And I think he'll ride off into the sunset after this year and retire. Next game would be two-seed Georgia taking on six-seed Penn State. Um, I don't think that one would be all that close. I think by that point, Georgia's in their, you know, postseason mode. I think Penn State would kind of have a means to an end. Like, while I think their offense will be improved this year and will get them to the final eight and everyone in Happy Valley will be happy with James Franklin for finally making the playoff, even winning a game, um, I think Georgia would just be too much. Um, so I would have one seed Ohio State playing five seed Oregon in the semifinal. Rematch for the third time this year. Um, I think if I were to pick how the games will go, I think they'll split. I think Oregon will get them in Eugene, and then Ohio State will get their revenge in the Big Ten Championship. And then I think Ohio State will just be too much. Um, I think they will prove in my eyes why they were the number one seed and beat them two out of three times to move on to the National Championship. And then two-seed Georgia Bulldogs taking on the three-seed Utah Utes. <laughs> Similar to Penn State, I think Georgia would just be too much. Um, and the magic run for the Utah Utes, Kyle Whittingham and Cam Rising would come to an end. And that leaves me with a super chalky national championship, Ohio State taking on Georgia. Uh, and I'm going to believe I'm a believer in Jim Knowles and I'm a believer in that backfield and their weapons and their line and offensive and defensive. Um, and while I have doubts about Will Howard, I think his experience will be all they need um, to get them over the hump. And as much as I believe in Georgia and Carson Beck, I think Ohio State will triumph. Um, Ryan Day will exercise his demons and we will all quit acting like he's a bad football coach. So Ohio State, your official national championship pick for Zach.